Google usually rolls out a software update for its Pixel devices in the first week of every month, while the October 2025 update for Pixel smartphones has already arrived, to everyone's surprise, the company has started rolling out another update for Pixel phones this month. The new software update is available for all Pixel devices from the Pixel 7 to Pixel 10 series, with the update weighing around 30 megabytes for Pixel 10 owners. The new build number for the latest Pixel 10 series ends in W4. The previous update ended with the W3. For those expecting new features, the update doesn't appear to bring any major additions. Google's release notes for this unexpected update didn't list anything, but Verizon's changelog did, and it mentions that this update provides performance improvements for your device. Is this the GPU driver update fix all of us Pixel users have been waiting for? The timing of this update is interesting since we're only days away from the next major Pixel release. Google has been working on the November update, which is expected to bring theme packs, the ability to create GIFs in Pixel Studio and more. It's possible that Google has delayed that rollout and decided to push this smaller security update first, though that's just speculation for now. It isn't confirmed, but it's possible that Google discovered a major security issue with Pixel devices and decided to release a small update early. The company could have bundled these changes with November's update, but maybe the issue may have been serious enough to push it ahead of schedule. Google made a statement earlier in the week that they are working on a GPU driver update for the Pixel 10 series, but it's unclear when that will roll out. For now, the update has not hit my phone. I keep on checking. Lucky for you, I'm going to flash the OTA without wiping my data using the Pixel Flasher tool. And let's test the performance of this device and see if Google finally upgraded the GPU drivers and gave these Pixel 10s a performance boost. First, you need to download the platform tools and the new available W4 Pixel update for your Pixel device, and then download the Pixel Flasher tool. You can use the official Android Flash tool developed by Google. However, it does wipe your data, even if you flash an OTA. So you will need to download the Pixel Flasher toolkit if you want to flash the new OTA and keep your data. Links for everything are down below in the description box. This is not a tutorial video. You should be able to figure it out. If you can't and need extra help, just comment down below and I can walk you through it. After downloading everything and flashing the new OTA update, it is time to head over to the Geekbench app to see if this update was about security or performance. I first started off with the GPU benchmark test because that is our main concern at this time. OpenCL first and then Volcan test second. We have been waiting so long for Google to get this right. And unfortunately, after testing the GPU, it appears the performance has gotten worse. The OpenCL score before this update scored 3,282, and after this W4 update, the OpenCL GPU test scored 3,224. Wow, let's check the Vulkan GPU test. Before this new update, the Vulkan GPU scored 3,714, and after the new W4 update, the Vulkan GPU scored 3,704. What a bummer. Well, maybe the performance update would improve the CPU benchmark scores since they still obviously didn't update the GPU drivers. So let's test the CPU benchmark again before and after. Um, before this new W4 update, the Pixel scored 2,327 in single core performance and 6,248 in multi-core score. After updating the Pixel 10 Pro to the new W4 update, the Pixel 10 Pro scored 2,320 in single core and 6,248 in multi-core score. I don't know what the Verizon changelog was talking about for this update because this update made the performance even worse on the Pixel. It's pretty clear this was just a security update Pixel users will have to wait for the official November update next week to see if Google implements the newly updated GPU drivers to boost performance. This is a bummer. I woke up all excited this morning, 
thinking Google developers had been watching my videos and finally decided to focus on performance of this device, I update my device and it technically got worse. Stay tuned for all your Pixel news and reviews. We'll just have to wait again in hopes Google addresses this performance issue.